Hello and welcome to this brief tutorial from biggerplate.com showing you how to format your mind manager for Mac mind maps. Now to begin formatting we need to open up the little sidebar that will appear on the right hand side and to do that we can either come up here and click on task panes or we can come up to format and if we say format topic you'll see you get this pop out on the side that then gives us lots of lovely formatting options. So for example I can change the fill color of a topic so let's change this one to a yellow, I can change the line around it to a blue, I can change the shape of it, the layout, the alignment, the margins, all sorts in here. So everything you need to format your topics you'll find in there. You'll also see up here you have the option to format the text within it in this separate sidebar. So here I can change the font, whether it's bold, italic, the size of it, the color, etc. If you wanted to apply a change to multiple topics, you can select multiple at the same time. So for example, if I select all of the topics within this style branch, click on style, I can then change them all to have, say, a red fill, and I can change the line to be a, let's go yellow. And you'll see that changes everything I've previously selected. If you didn't want to individually format topics like I'm doing at the moment, you can choose from a selection of pre-made themes by coming up to format, map theme, apply from chooser, and you can select from one of these themes. You'll see when I select one now, because I've pre-edited individual topics, that will override the theme. So if I, for example, select professional rectangle, it'll change the shapes of things, but the colors that I've already input to these branches will stay as they are. So if I say choose, you'll see the shapes change, but the colors that I've already done stay the same. But if you didn't want to go to the effort that I have of individually formatting branches, you can select one of those themes at the outset, and it'll automatically provide a bit of visual impact through some color and formatting. Hopefully that's all you need to get started formatting your mind manager for Mac mind maps. For more mind manager templates, tutorials and training, visit biggerplate.com.